goes directly to... Oh, I've done it the wrong way. I'm such an idiot. Okay, we'll have to swap these. Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new build series. I know, it's been a while. Has been a while actually. Um, I started off doing Planet Coaster and Roller Coaster Tycoon. I do love my building games and it's probably the only thing that I do take semi-seriously. So this is an early access game called Sim Airport. Um, now basically what it is, is very tycoon style business management game uh, where we build an airport, manage some contracts of some airlines, build the physical assets such as the ticketing area, security, uh, manage staff levels, manage customers uh, essentially and run an airport. It's really simple, it's really nice. Graphics are very sharp, it's, it's not quite cartoony, it's not quite realistic. Gameplay wise, it's massively good. I've had a huge play around so far um, and, and done various lots of different things in the game and to be honest I love it so far. What I've done first of all is started off as a career mode with no template airport. As you can see we've got a big em empty map. So I'm going to build an airport from scratch. Now there is a few bugs in the game. Um, it is very early access. The developers have been bang on in rolling out updates daily at one point. Um, and they actually respond to feedback on Twitter and uh, lots of other YouTubers that have been starting to play this series have been getting some personalised feedback from them in direct response to some of the issues they've experienced. Now that is just exactly what Early Access is all about and probably is probably what we want to see from Steam's new platform uh, when that eventually goes live. But for now, this is what we have uh, and it's really good. So without further ado, we'll jump straight into it. So the first thing we're going to do is sort out these zones. So these are the outside external zones. I'm going to dezone everything here, first of all. Uh, now what we're going to do is we're going to put garbage down here, right out of the way, because, you know, garbage isn't really something that needs to be by the entrance of the airport. Uh, what we'll have is we'll have... What do we want? Office deliveries. Deliveries, probably. We'll do further up in a minute. So we'll have drop-offs here. So this is where customers are dropped off. Let's make that quite big. Let's make that 20 by 4. And we'll have pickups. Also 20 by 4. So we'll try and we'll try and build this round so that it, it looks appropriate. So we'll try and put the entrance and the exit in the right place. Uh, Hopefully the drop-offs will go into the entrance and the pickups will go to the exit. That's the idea anyway. Uh, and lastly, we'll put deliveries here. Cool. Now for our garbage area, what we do need is uh, some dumpsters. So we'll put those there. Now I've only got a million dollars, which sounds like a lot, but I feel like it's going to be one of those things that it just, whoosh, it's gone flies by. Uh, let's build this. So let's build a sidewalk. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. So I think what happens is the parts and stuff that we need to build the floor gets delivered, yep, to the delivery area. And now we need to hire some workmen who pick up those deliveries, take them over here and build the stuff. So we do need some staff early on. And it's annoying because they will start taking wage already before we've even got the airport set up. But you know what? That's all right. Can't do nothing about that. Um, so we'll leave them to get on with that. Let's start building the airport. So we want the entrance area to come over here. That looks like it could be fairly big actually. We'll worry about that in a minute when we get to it. Okay, so that's been delivered. Speed this up a bit, actually. 
Well, this is going to take a bloody long time. Well, we can always fire these guys, so let's just whack a few down here. Okay, so down here I want the drop-offs to have the baggage reclaim area down there. So I'm going to build a exit from the gate security area over here. And we'll probably have security over here. This can be our gate area. Okay, nice and simple to start with, just so we can see what we're doing. That's a lot of money. <laughs> Whoopsie doodle. Alright, we'll let these guys get on and build, first of all. Okay, so while these guys are building that, um, and we've got wages slowly being taken for these guys, probably should start building some of the ticketing area. So, what we want is some... What do we want? What are they called? Ticketing kiosk. Oh, ticketing desk. So these things are automated. Uh, you know, you go into the airport and you've got these automated ticket things where you scan your boarding pass and your ID uh, and it automatically prints your, your ticket, etc. Or the other way around. Um, and this is where you actually go to check in your baggage uh, if you haven't got, if you have got bags. Uh, so we'll need both. Uh, ideally, we want to get people going through these ticketing kiosks so we don't have to employ staff members for them. Um, but obviously, we will need uh, some of these. So we'll put some up here, first of all. Let's put... We'll put three there. We could put some of these. Like that. That's a good idea. Right, so we'll need to give this the ticketing zone. And we'll build a sliding door. Here. That goes directly to... Oh, I've done it the wrong way. I'm such an idiot. Okay, we'll have to swap these. Zones. So... So that becomes pickups. That becomes drop-offs. So that becomes drop-offs there. Actually, we didn't want to do that far up. And pickups can go here. Excellent. That's what we want. Uh, ticketing desk. Yeah, we've got a ticketing desk. Oh, it's under construction. So until that's done, the requirements won't be met for that. Okay, so this is the ticketing hall. So we need some queues. the best way to do this. Probably don't need one for those, do we? So we'll just put queues there. And we'll assign... Actually, no, I need those to be built first of all, don't we? So we'll leave that for now. Over here... Okay, so I just need to quickly clear this wall. And then we'll put the baggage claim area here on the way out. This will be the security area and this will be the airport gates here. Um, now I'm aware I need to build the runway which is actually going to be catastrophically busy, uh, expensive. Um, so we'll get this done first of all so we can see where we're at. Okay, so this has been built. Now we can assign the queue like so. And that'll mean these queues feed these particular things. No ticket in desk. Uh, maybe it's because there's no staff on it. But we're not we're not going to staff it for now because we don't need that, quite frankly. Okay, so that's finished being built now. Excellent. So we can hopefully put down this. That's annoying. Why won't that work? We might have to put it this side. Ok, 
Okay, we'll do that. We'll build. We'll put that down there, and then we'll just build this little area as a little inroad here. So, like that. And we'll clear this wall. That should do it. Okay, so we have our airport gate here. Now, I'm just going to put these down here because I want toilets to be here. So we'll put that there. Now, hopefully I can put a door on there that's going to fit. Um, what have we got here? Mm, sliding door. Ah, there we go. Good. So we can put that there. So... Here I need to now put a gate agent desk. There we go. So when that's built, that will hopefully provide a place where we can then put a queue for customers who then go into there, then board their plane, and off they go. So whilst that's being done, okay, requires secure area, requires at least one gate agent desk to be assigned, requires secure area. Okay, so one thing I didn't think about is the secure fence. Hopefully this won't cost too much. It's not as much as I thought it was going to be actually. That's alright. No, that's alright. That wasn't too bad. Okay, so let's put down the runway first of all. Now this is what I think is going to be expensive. 100 grand. That's actually not too bad, is it? Um... That's a significant dent in the budget there. Okay, so let's assign that to there. So that should take care of at least one of those requirements. Yep, okay. So when this, when this wall's built, that should make this whole area secure. This fence even. Uh, and then we need two adjacent taxiways, which hopefully one and two there. I think we also need a hangar as well. Um, Small hanger, we do. Mm. Let's just build that for now. Don't want to spend too much because um, I'm not really sure <laughs> what it's actually for. So we'll just we'll leave that there for now. Um, let's start fixing this in here as well. So we need to clear this wall. This wall. And that hopefully should be it. Okay, so let's put our baggage claim area down here. And we'll put our baggage carousel here. Good. And lastly, we'll put our door to the outside world. There. Anyway, guys, that is the end of the first episode of Sim Airport. Hopefully, you enjoyed. Uh, I'm not really sure how to take it forward in terms of the format, uh, but we'll probably work it out as we go along. I'll try and keep these episodes around 15 minutes each time because I know a lot of people get bored with the long ass episodes. So we'll try and keep it nice and simple. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. If you do, leave a like, leave a comment on what I can do better. Any kind of input that you guys have got, uh, whether it be suggestions, feedback, things I'm doing wrong, please keep me updated as I go along. It's what makes these build projects so good is when people give me advice and tips and tell me off when I'm doing something wrong. Anyway, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the very next episode, probably soon. Cheers!